topic for this week is top five books that I can't remember. What is this? Revealed. Marked is the first book in this trilogy. It's not a trilogy. It's definitely not a trilogy. There's 12 books. Hey guys, it's Jay and I'm here with another Top 5 Little Wednesday. It was created by Ginger Reads Laney, so I will leave her link down below if you want to check that out. The topic for this week is the best suggested books that you loved, so books that were recommended to you. The books that I have are in no particular order, they're just in a pile and I'm going to pick them up and show them to you. So without further ado, let us get started! The first book I have is the Hunger Games by Suzanne Collins. I didn't really think that I was going to pick these up originally and then my mom bought the whole trilogy and she read them and she loved them so she was like you need to read them because they're super good so I ended up reading them. Always listen to your mother children because she's always right. The next book that I loved that was recommended to me is Divergent by Veronica Roth. Same thing as the Hunger Games, I wasn't going to read these books and then the movie was coming out my mom wanted to read it, she read it, she loved it, and told me that I needed to read it. So, I did. And I loved it. Again, listen to your parents. The next book is Revealed. Marked is the first book in this series. There's like 12 books in it. This is the 11th book. I've read up to the 8th and then I just didn't continue with it because it was taking too long for the books to come out and then... I just didn't want to read the whole series again to remember everything. This is the House of Night series by PC Cast and Kristen Cast. I read it when I was like 12 years old and it was recommended to me by my cousin Elizabeth. I think the first five books that I have are actually hers. I just never gave them back to her when she lent them to me and then I bought the rest myself, but I stole them from her. I'm sorry, Elizabeth. But they're good books, thank you. The next book that I'm going to show you is the Georgia Nicholson series. This is the tenth book. It's by Louise Renison. It's this huge series that follows this British girl named Georgia Nicholson, and it is absolutely hilarious. It was recommended to me by my cousin Denver. I only have the tenth book, but I borrowed all of her books when I read the series, and it's just hilarious. Kind of like lower level reading, but it's worth it. It is so worth it. And finally, I'm going to go with Slammed by Colleen Hoover. I could go with any Colleen Hoover book because everybody always recommends me to go with Colleen Hoover. At the beginning of this year, I'd never read a Colleen Hoover book in my life, and now I'm like on a Colleen Hoover like kick and it's like all I pick up because she's such a good writer. I read this one at the beginning of January. I absolutely loved it. I read Point of Retreat and I read Hopeless. I really liked Hopeless. I didn't really like Point of Retreat. I feel like Colleen Hoover is kind of like a hit and miss author, so it depends the mood you're in if you're going to like her books or not. I don't know. It's weird. Alright guys, so that was my top five Wednesday for this week. I will see you in my next video. Goodbye!